biggest fear is just is just failing, and uh, I feel the, uh, the the weight of that hugely every day I sit here. It gives me some sort of strength, uh, some sort of purpose to think. Well, if the poor old Mawson was sitting there in blizzard conditions, at least I can I can honestly say that I've been served up the same sorts of conditions as he had. After two days, the blizzard eases, giving Tim a chance to get moving. I got really despondent, I must say, uh, quite depressed. Uh, at times I was fine, at times I was really down in the dumps thinking, God, if this, you know, lasts for three, four days, it's going to stop my chances of making it. With one third of his journey to go and food disappearing fast, Tim must brave the conditions and make some ground. After three days, the blizzard broke for Mawson. There appeared to be little hope of reaching the hut still a hundred miles away. But I braced myself, determined to put up a good fight. I hadn't had my socks off for a few days, but this was a shock. The thickened skin of the soles of my feet had separated as a complete layer and the watery fluid had saturated the socks. Several of my toes had commenced to blacken and fester. I began to wonder if there ever was to be a day without some special disappointment. 